Cheney, the ball carrier. And there's going to be a flag for a face mask. The helmet came off. Andre White, I think, is going to be guilty of Georgia Tech. Caesar. Personal foul, face mask, defense, number three. Second, not with five seconds left on the play clock. And it's pulled with four. And here is Parrish. And he will get seven, almost eight on first down. And Miami got to try and manage the final two minutes. Here is Cheney. And will that be enough for the first down? It's close. We'll see how they spot the football. It is enough for the first down. Shotgun set here for Van Dyke. They got to hand the ball to Cheney. There's the first down. And all of a sudden, a little bit of a scrum at the 30, but nonetheless, the Miami first down. And well, about the time Van Dyke handed it to him, Cheney got hit. Brent Key uses his last time out now with 118 to court. Van Dyke. Cheney again. He'll reach the 30. Georgia Tech's out of timeouts with 72 seconds to go. Braylon Oliver, the Minnesota transfer, the stop for Brent Key's defense. Before he said, just yeah, take a knee. Like yeah. You should not be handing this football off. Right. I don't know what Miami is doing. That's it. And here's Cheney. The straight ahead tackled, and the ball popped out. He's got to read the clock. I mean, read the card. I mean, to and me, Georgia Tech has it with 26 seconds left. Kyle Kennard comes up with the fumble. You should not be running the football. I mean, it, it is. It, you should be taking a knee. As soon as you got that first down, they used that last time out. As long as you milk it all the way down, you don't need to be doing this, and you certainly don't need to be fighting for extra yards. Is it out as he hits the ground or is he on the ground? He might Elbow be down. down. He's, he's a guy who, by the way, is trying to rip the football out. I mean, there are a oh. number of layers here to this. Is even if you were running plays. To further review, the ruling on the field stands. First down, Georgia Tech. So with 26 seconds left, Miami commits its fourth turnover of the night on the fumble by Cheney. And stop the clock by spiking it. Snap to King. Miami brings four. King's in trouble. Throw it behind the intended receiver Cooley incomplete. You guys that are way down the field. Three to the field for King. Up in the pocket. Going to loop it down the field. And it is caught. And that's Rutherford who hangs on to it in Miami territory. And you got to get up and clock it. The cleats have got to be in the ground as soon as the whistle, as soon as they wind it, you got to clock it. Here's King. He will clock it. Four seconds come off the clock with the receivers to the top of the screen. Here's King from the pocket. Flush to his right with six. Five. Going to loop it downfield. And ball is caught. Touchdown, Georgia Tech. With one second to go in the ball game, Christian Leary hauls it in. I mean, I'm going to say it. It needs to be said. That's one of the biggest coaching mistakes at this level that I have ever seen in my lifetime. You should not be running the football. You run the football or fumbles, and then you give up a score. That is devastating for a 4-0 Miami team to get their first loss of the season on a sequence like that. Haynes King throws to Christian Leary from 44 yards. And Georgia Tech is going to steal one in the thick of the night in South Florida. Here's Van Dyke looking, flips it to the middle of the field. This is Restrepo. He'll dance. The clock is expired. And Xavier Restrepo's got to look for help. Now he's going to throw it back across the field. And here is Colby Young coming to the near side. Now Young going to give it back to Van Dyke. He's going to sling it back to Restrepo. Miami trying to string this play out. Schoolyard style. Now to Young, middle of the field. Kobe Young looking for some help. He's going to throw it back, and this is Jacoby George. Now he'll dance with it. George trying to make a move with it. Ball got knocked loose, and the game is over. The playground style at the end did not help Miami. Brent Key has gotten another ranked road win as the head coach of Georgia Tech.